Do you still have your recycling bin, or did you have to say bye-bye, blue bin? Rick Cabrera tells us why some are feeling blue over their blue bins in this ABC7 Listens. The blue bin recycling program came to El Paso more than a decade ago, and some of you may have recently gone outside and noticed your bin was gone from Ken. I received a door tag this morning after recyclable trucks went by. The notice says they took my blue recycling bin because of excessive trash and that I would have to attend a class to get it back. No warning, no explanation as to what was found. I think it's very unreasonable since I pay my bills and taxes every year. It's a joke. We actually reported on this last month and on October 25th, the City of El Paso's Environmental Services Department started what it called a recycling bin audit in a quote, effort to decrease the amount of trash found in recycling bins and save taxpayer money. According to the city, the amount of non-recyclable items has increased dramatically, which increased the fees the city pays to Friedman Recycling. So crews have been checking your blue bins, and if it was determined the majority of its contents was non-recyclable, your bin was taken away, and you can only get it back by taking a free recycling class. City spokesman Rick Isaias told me there's only been one class so far, it was held at the Municipal Services Center, took an hour, and about 10 people attended. Here's a reminder about what is not allowed in the blue bins. No yard waste, food, pizza boxes, diapers, styrofoam, glass, clothing, and electronics. For now, another audit isn't planned, but better safe than sorry. Rick Cabrera, ABC7 Listens. Thanks.